This is a short demonstration of how to use the AVR butterfly from Atmel to control a desk lamp uh, using relays. Uh, I've also added a keypad to make the uh, input from the user uh, a little bit easier. So, um, desk lamp is connected uh, to the relays. Uh, in this case, just one of the two available relays. So this device can control, uh, this AVR butterfly can control uh, two devices. If we power up the, the unit, we will see that the first screen that is displayed is the current time. Since there, it has just been powered up, it starts counting from, uh, from midnight. So, first thing we would like to do is to set the time. The time can be set by holding the center button and accessing the main menu. The first option in the main menu is the set T, which is for set the time, and we can go into this menu by pressing down. We then enter the current time, which is 10.54. 54. If I realize that I've made a mistake, I can always press the star at any time and it will go back to the beginning. So 10, 54, and the hash key to confirm. Time is now set with confirmation and you are sent back to the home screen. So in order to control the the lamp, we have to go into the menu and look at the devices. Um, we have here on the home screen a small one and a small two. That is to show the two channels, the two relays that are available. So if we would like to control the desk lamp, uh, in this case it is connected to channel one. Again we go into the main menu and we see there's the time set. We go to the next one by pushing right to device one. When we enter device one, we have the timed option or we have a countdown timer option. Going into the timed option by going down, we can see the on at. If we select it by going down, we can then enter the time at which the lamp should turn on. We will make it at 1057. Confirm with the hash. Next menu is off at. Again, we confirm with going down and we say 1058 and confirm. We have a check option if we wish. Just to double check, we can go into this by pressing down and it'll cycle through the screens on at 1057, off at 1058. At any time, we can press the center button to go back to the home screen. And now it will be 10.57 and the light turns on. So another visual confirmation that the light that the relay is actually on will be that underneath the channel is the small arrow and we are now approaching 1058 and the light is turned off and the small arrow that was underneath channel 1 is now disappeared to indicate that this channel is now off So another thing which we can do, instead of having uh, it on a timer mode, we can have it in countdown timer mode. So going back to the main menu, we can go back to device one and say countdown. And in countdown, we can say either on in sometime or off in sometime. 
if on in we can say uh, access on in and say that it must be on and we can type in the uh, hours and minutes anything up to 23 hours and 59 minutes so we can say it should be on turn on in one minute except we now see the countdown timer mode and we can see the small one in the corner two has disappeared um, we are now focusing only on device one Here we have five four three two one on the light will now permanently stay on because it has reached we must turn on in some time to cancel this feature while displaying the countdown timer screen one presses down to clear the countdown timer mode similarly we can set for a turn off in some time so again we access device one for countdown but off in one minute and accept the light is now on and again to show that the relay is actually on the small arrow underneath channel 1 is lit up 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 off so yes, that was a quick demonstration of how an AVR butterfly can be used to control two relays and other appliances or devices. Thank you for watching.